Okay, guys, so there's been a bit of a lapse since that last second in the video. Um, we're right where we were. Totally nothing different happened before this. I like birds. That's good, Luke 2.0. I, I mean, Luke. So, <clears throat> we just learned that the Exchange is a big crime outfit that mostly operates out of Nar Shaddaa. They do spice running, gun trafficking, slave trading, and now they post bounties on Jedi. Uh, the three options we have for saying anything are why would they offer a bounty on Jedi? Or the Exchange is trying to kill Jedi? Or were the Jedi interfering with the Exchange's operations? Took me a moment to get into the Jedi voice. Uh, what do you guys think we should say? I'd just say the third one because the Jedi are always in danger. There's, you shouldn't be surprised. <laughs> I am honestly not surprised. Like, what? People are killing Jedi and people are going after Jedi? Oh, man. Wow. Oh, man. It's like every that's, couple that's, centuries with this. That's a, that's a shocker. Pretty soon there's going to be a giant fucking war. Going to have clones, probably. Be super sweet. Isaiah, what do you think I sh we should say? I think that if you look inside yourself, you'll find the answer was there all along. So the third one. Yep. Don't know much about it. <laughs> okay, that, that means he wasn't paying attention. Okay, so this guy doesn't know why they'd want to go after Jedi. And then he said that there's not a lot of Jedi left and that he wouldn't be surprised if the bounty is high. So now we've got two options here. Not many Jedi left. What happened to them? Or what happened to them? Did the exchange wipe them all out? Stop over hunting the Jedi. I uh, hmm. I don't want to get the second one, but what what did happen to them? Isaiah, do you have anything to add? Um, I don't know what happened to them, Luke. I'm sorry. I know. I'm just saying, like Isaiah, you I'm should pretty, know this. I want to pick this. Sure, I want to pick the second I'm option. Sure but Darth Vader happened. This is way before Darth Vader, dude. This is before I'm pretty he sure. Twinkle in his Lord Palpatine. Ha Lord Palpatine happened. Before That's what happened. he was even a preteen. I'm pretty sure Jabba the Hut happened. <sighs> Isaiah, I'm just saying, like. I don't know crap about Star Wars, you guys. Oh. But you're I, a premier Star Wars scholar, don't you say that? You okay, know Jason, everything. please put this in a flashback. As I do recall, I asked Jason if this was, like, post-Clone Wars, and he said this was, like, a thousand years before <laughs> Clone Wars. I'll flashback if you want. Okay, so, I'll just hit number one, then. The ones that weren't killed in Luke, are you editing? No, he is. No, oh, he's editing in this video? Yeah, it's his. It's his video. Okay, so I'll be the singing Jedi French. were killed in the Jedi Civil War... Um, a lot of them ended up just quitting being Je Okay, apparently you can quit being a Jedi. Wait, dude, 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 that should be a freaking movie, a Jedi Civil War. How cool would that be? It, it happened, apparently. Yeah, I'd, and, I'd see that movie. Yeah, and word is, there's not even a Jedi Council anymore. But who knows? So we, we got three, three options again. I'd heard rumors of a war, but a war between Jedi? <laughs> no shit. Or... <laughs> The stories I heard were of the Sith, not the Jedi. Or, was it caused by the Mandalorian Wars? Does anyone no, let's just remember what Mandalorians are? No. Uh, the predecessors to Boba Fett. Essentially space marines, but born that way. Eh. Let's just blame everything on the Sith. Blame everything on the Sith like everyone in the movies? Yep. That's it. Are you pro Sith, uh, banging on Sith? Wallet sound? Yes. Go. Evil Siths. Fuck the Sith. Yeah, Revan, Malak, and the Jedi that went to join them in the Mandalorian Wars. They turned against the other Jedi and had a scrap that almost laid waste to the galaxy. <laughs> Where have you been? Okay, so, uh, Jedi named Revan, a Jedi named Malak, and the Jedi that joined them walked into a bar and then a civil war happened because they turned into the Sith and nearly wiped out the whole galaxy. So and it was the Sith's fault. Where have you been? Oh my god, we have six options for this next one. And I dropped something on the floor, so one sec. Okay, we got six options. Um, I've heard a few rumors, but little else in my travels. I've been 
away since the Mandalorian Wars. Thousand yard stare. Number three, just tell me what happened next. Your story is so riveting. Four, what happened between Revan and Malak? Did they, did they kiss? Five, I couldn't care less about Revan's fate. I had other questions for you. Or six, I've heard enough. Let me ask you something else. Yeah, I heard enough. You've heard enough, Luke? You, you don't care about this anymore? No, I just want to get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Good point. Isaiah, do you want to hear any more about, you know, the Jedi Civil War? Yes, I want to hear all of the histories. <laughs> okay, we're going to flip a Canadian coin on this. Um, Excuse me, this uh, is no, the United no, no, States. Oh, well, yeah, Ma Maple I use any of your... All I have on me is a Canadian exchange. coin that some jackass used at work, okay? I'm just saying, he, let me flip an American coin. No, yeah, I don't Maple want a coin with a British Maple queen. Leaf means we pick Luke's choice. And Queen Elizabeth, the... Oh. No, that's actually... No, it's Elizabeth II, my bad. That thing's more American than a Texas state quarter. Okay. Just saying. So Queen Elizabeth will be Isaiah, as is fitting, since Isaiah is the one of us that looks most like the Queen Elizabeth. Or we will pick Luke if we get a maple leaf, because Luke is sweet. I am not sweet. I am sexy. And we had Queen He's Elizabeth. So, yes. Um, Read me all of the histories. Okay. I'll just say I've been away since the Mandalorian Wars. You know, I've had shit to do. I don't read newspaper. Well, I wasn't there, but like all Sith, Revan and Malak turned okay, on so each Revan other. Okay, so Revan and Malak totally turned, turned on, on each other first. after, you know, cheating on each other. And uh, then four options again. The rumors I heard said Revan defeated Malak, then went to Korriban to unite the Sith against the Republic. Or, I was led to believe that Revan saved the Jedi and the Republic. Or, I couldn't care less about Raven's fate. I had other questions for you. Or, I've had enough. Let me ask you something else. So, the other two kind of infer that we actually know something. Well, what, what is that? I, I thought I Raven that... did the thing at the place. Yeah. For the Sith or the Jedi? For the Jedi. I guess. There's rumors all over space. <laughs> for the guys oh, with the blue lightsabers. He says, I guess, there's rumors all over space. No women. And he heard that Revan had returned to pay Malik back for trying to kill her in the first place. <laughs> you know, women. That is the <laughs> actual line. <laughs> you know, women. And and then we have two options here. How long have you been in that cage? Revan was a man, not a woman. Or two, I had heard Revan's redemption involved her stopping Malik, and she had no choice but to fight him. Okay. Was this big historical figure a lady or a dude? A lady, obviously. Thank you, Protag, for joining the Helping Star She's a lady! Lady! Oh, female! <laughs> dude looks like a lady. Okay. Well, I wasn't there, thankfully. But I heard what she was like during the Mandalorian. Because you know there aren't that many female in space, apparently. Now he's made another woman joke about... When a woman falls to the dark side... You better space yourself. I want our guy to be sexist now. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've already got one sexist person around here. Okay, we got three options. I had some more questions for you. This discussion about Revan is pointless. I need to know what happened to here, in the now. Or enough history. Let me ask you something else. Where'd you get that tie? What do you guys think? Meow. <laughs> I'll what? send you my uh, thoughts telepathically. I... Oh, okay. Okay. Mm, potatoes. Stop, stop. Uh, okay. I think you killed Jason, Isaiah. The pain. The pain. Corey got you Skyrim for Christmas last year. It's so stupid. Not Skyrim, but the things he put in my head are so stupid. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh hi 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 Mark. Potatoes? Why would you do that with peanut butter? You I was curious. You're sick. You're sick in the head. Did you tell him about the lizards and the peanut butter again? Uh, oh, I, I I think we're getting off track. Do we wanna know more about the Civil War? Or do we wanna be rude and tell him that he is pointless and wanna know what happened here? 
Or do you want to be polite and ask about something that happened here? You know what, you know what, since we already are choosing to learn a little bit more about the Civil War, let's just continue learning about it. Okay. Look, no offense or anything, but your weird half-naked And he says our weird half-naked interrogation in isn't his idea of a fun time. Jedi the miners were talking oh, well, fuck him. Weird. Tell us more about the Civil War. Shit, he just put two and two together. My half-nakedness and the fact that I know absolutely nothing about the Civil War, he's realized I'm a Jedi. Because <laughs> that's totally indicative of being Wait a Jedi. Wait a second. <laughs> Wait a second. He's curved to the left. He's a Jedi. <laughs> okay, and now he wants... Now he wants to know where everyone is. Um, one. I don't know. This facility seems abandoned. Or two. Don't you know what happened to them? Or three. Stop playing dumb, doo-doo head. You must have seen what took place. D stop it. No. no. Stop it right now. Don't no, do that. You're should, not nice. I don't know. We should probably ask him if he knows what, it, why he doesn't know what happened here. Well, he is in a laser jail cell. I know, but still, he, that means he could see what happened. Okay, but our so, guy has a real laser. But shh, uh, and ask a question. It's only a mining laser. So, option number two? Hi. Or do we want to be rude about it? Um, Luke, Isaiah, rudeness or not? To be rude uh, or not to be rude? Be rude. That's so it would like word. a would a laser gel be like one of those bead doors, but instead of beads, they just have like lightsabers hanging from the top? <laughs> oh my! <laughs> no, God. Isaiah. It means there's lasers come instead of bars. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, Isaiah's idea. Is totally correct. Do not question it. <laughs> but you're saying the lightsabers are just hanging out like freaking fly buzzers. All right, yeah. honey. I don't have my pants on. You Why would you do that? It's so tantalizing. Meat. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, my fingers. Mm. <laughs> Come in. I boy. love the smell of burnt flesh in the morning. Apparently, we're being rude. And we've gotten off track. Yeah, let's be rude. from my beautiful view. In from the his beautiful page. view in the security Look, cell, he heard, um, some he heard some explosions, some emergency, some emergency alarms, alarms, and toxic smelled gas some toxic gas vents. pouring Maybe into the none vents. Of them survived whatever happened. And, and he thinks all they're gone. all dead. Look, well, okay. we are. And he Let wants us to get him out of his laser cell. I can't. I've got he was a dick. Should we do stuff. this? Okay. Ooh, we've got five options. Um, number one, which uses our persuasion skill, which means we we'd be very persuasive. Tell me your plan. And we can go from there. Or two, how can you help? Three, I don't think so. Four, seems to me you were locked up for a reason. Or five, how could you possibly be of any use to me? I don't think so, Broski. Be a dick. No be a way. Dick. The last Jose. one. The last one. Be a dick. Be a dick. Okay, one for five, and I think two for three. See, it's between I don't think so, and how could you possibly have any be of any use to me? I don't think so, cause you're not nice. And hello, hello. I I went wait what I I thought I said no way Jose. Aww. Okay, so number three. I don't think so. Just in case you don't understand the trouble we're in, let me lay it out for you. Okay, he thinks we're being stupid. He's telling us that we're in a facility that's a series of <laughs> mining tunnels. You're stupid! And everything you do is stupid! And your intelligence is stupid! Parents. I told you we should have been a dick and just been like, how can you possibly help me? Remember? It will make you say sham wow! Oh shit. <laughs> Any, anything stronger than a mining lady. Used in here will that means when one decides blow up the entire the asteroid field. Come along for the ride. Well, that's not our problem. You might survive. It's sort of a hundred. No, it's not. We're in it. You'll be right. No, we're sitting here Jedi. listening to a guy here, you can cling to the who has that problem. This guy is basically a schizophrenic. Okay, so he's essentially just told me that this place will explode if I go off on my own. It's a bit over the top. Number one. Do you have some Return sort of this land. Come on. Or two. Somewhere in your idiotic rant, you failed to explain how you could be of any use to me. Hey, Protag, your option came up, but with an idiotic rant. I told hey, you. I choose dick option this time. You mean you mean the idiotic rant? 